Matt, what's going on with Carlos Slim? Well, he's having a hard time keeping uh, his monopoly intact, essentially. Um, as Latin America doesn't grow as fast as it used to, uh, America Mobile cannot bring in as much earnings, can't keep its margins. Uh, an analyst uh, that we quoted in the story this morning says, it, you know, there's uh, increasing resistance to America Mobile's dominance. And mm. if that is going to continue to go on, more than 50% of Carlos Slim's fortune is based in America Mobile, you're going to see his fortune shrink. Right, you'll see that shrink then. Right. So is his fortune being propped up by other holdings? It then? is. He has, uh, he has financial holdings. He has uh, infrastructure holdings. He has other holdings that have not fallen like America Mobile has. And so as long as he has those multi-billion dollar holdings, he will probably be able to have some semblance of a lead over Bill Gates. But all it would take is you know Microsoft doesn't actually move you know a great deal at, like it used to. Um, if Microsoft moved a couple bucks, you could actually see him. Well, take I was going to say, I mean, as we're seeing Slim's ranking drop, or at mm. least his uh, fortune drop, are we seeing Bill's? Uh, you know, sort of, is there momentum up? Uh, well, Bill Gates, actually, most of his fortune is not in Microsoft anymore. It's actually in an investment company called Cascade. Mm -hmm. And so um, I, I would say it's actually three quarters of his fortune is in Cascade. So as those uh, publicly traded stocks and those closely held assets swell, uh, you see his fortune tend to go on the upside. Um, but Microsoft is actually the biggest driver. You could actually see it go a couple billion dollars. Okay, well, uh, we shall see. And anything else going on among the top ten? Yeah, watch out for Warren Buffett and Amancio Ortega. The big news last year was that Amancio Ortega took the number three spot from Warren Buffett, uh, the the difference between the this two is the of them. Zara guy, right? The Zara guy, the, okay. the fashion guy from Spain. Um, what's going on right now? It's less than two billion dollars. And if between Berkshire them. Hathaway, yeah, and if Berkshire Hathaway opened up a little bit and index was down today, you could actually see a flip flop.